and gentlemen good afternoon welcome back to the Lewis basketball network i am back here with another one today's games celtics bucks i have the bucks winning game one uh score i'm gonna go with 110 to 100 i predict Giannis will have a 30 point near triple double with 30 points 13 rebounds and about eight assists tonight i think Kyrie irving is probably gonna have 25 points seven assists five rebounds uh i think both guys are gonna shoot well I think the Bucks uh, depth is going to show against Boston, and I have the Celtics winning game one. Golden State Warriors against the Houston Rockets. Um, even though Golden State has a quick turnaround, I got the Golden State Warriors beating the Houston Rockets. And if I'm the Golden State Warriors, I take a page out of the Utah Jazz book and play backwards defense on James Harden. And the reason being is because with that with that style of playing defense, it actually made the Rockets one of the worser offensive teams uh in the playoffs uh, with that style of play. The problem was the Jazz just couldn't score. So they didn't have the firepower to match the Rockets. And the Rockets made key baskets, you know, when they needed them because they have the ability to get hot. So they're a very streaky team and they live and die by the three. But um, but I honestly think that uh, that style of defense was actually very effective. It was unorthodox because it's like, who plays hard and from behind? But it's because of the step back threes. So they said, we're gonna force you into the middle of the floor and we're gonna, you're gonna have to beat us with twos with more mid-range because James Harden is not a mid-range shooter. He either shoots a three or he drives to the basket to either draw fouls or throws the floater or go for the lob. So that's going to be key. And uh, we need to remember something as well. Andre Iguodala is healthy this time. It wasn't like last year when he was not healthy. This time he's healthy. So we're going to see as long as he doesn't get hurt and the Warriors stay intact, even with DeMarcus Cousins, I still have the Warriors winning this series. The Rockets will play hard. I know people are saying, well, Kevin Durant's going to get exposed and watch Curry's going to get exposed and watch the Rockets are going to be. It depends on James Harden is going to have to be more efficient if they're going to win, because I don't think, in my opinion, that they could play. He could play his style and honestly believe that it's going to beat the Warriors. Um, Chris Paul has to hope that he doesn't get healthy. He has to be a floor general and he has to shoot the ball better, too. Because I don't think with him, Harden and CP3 struggling that they're going to be able to, to beat. Houston has a chance. Don't get me wrong. They have a chance to beat Golden State. I just think Golden State is going to win. Fortunately for Clay and Curry, their ankles came out clean. Uh, I think Curry's good to go. Clay is questionable. Hopefully, they'll both be ready to be able to play. I think Clay's is really swollen and looked in bad shape. But at least he has no structural damage to his ankle. So that's a good sign. Um, either... I think Steve Kerr is going to have to lower his minutes because this is a seven-game series. And I think use him in moments to win to guard James Harden. Now, not like all the time. Uh, and I think uh, Kevin Durant is going to show out in this game. Uh, hopefully, Steph Curry shows out this game. Hopefully, both sides, ho both the stars of Harden and Paul and Curry and Durant, you know, show out and, you know, give us a good game. But I got the Warriors winning today. Score, I'm going to say 118 118 102 today um i think the warriors are going to come out and uh knowing what the clippers did for them really woke them up gave them a challenge and they're going to punch them in the mouth today i think both teams are going to feel each other out at first you know to see how the game and then the pace of the game is going to go i'm really interested to see what kind of pace houston is going to play are they going to play half court are they going to push the ball up so interested to see. But I think even with the quick turnaround and Houston had more rest, damn, Houston was really disrespectful in, um, you know, disrespecting the Clippers, thinking that they weren't even going to have a game seven, that, you know, they had they came to they came early because they knew the Warriors was going to win. Man. Yeah, I was kind of harsh. But, you know, it is what it is, man. And um, But I got those team teams winning tonight, uh, winning today, the Bucks, and I got the Warriors. Uh, let me know who you guys think is going to win uh the celtics and the bucks and with the warriors and with the rockets uh let me know try to give me a stat line as to who you think is going to be you know who's going to show out today and who do you think is the x factor um for each team in the series let me know down in the comments so with another one is always bless up my love peace thanks for watching